Hey what's up guys, in this video I am going to show you how you can use your tablets or your smartphone as your secondary display for your PC or Mac. So guys the OS platforms does not matter whether it's Windows or Mac as the method is pretty much the same. Ok now go to link 1 from the description that will give you the app for your iOS or Android depending upon what you use download it on your device. I have included the app links for both iOS and Android platforms. Now go ahead and hit link 2 from the description that will take you to this page from where you can download this software for your PC or Mac. Install it and restart your computer. After restarting, launch the application on both the laptop and tablet. And also make sure both your devices are connected to the same Wi-Fi. Now choose the device you want to connect to. So for me it's the MacBook. There you go guys, now we have a secondary display. You can drag the window uh, to the right hand side to see it in the secondary screen. To bring it back to the main screen, drag it from the secondary screen to the left hand side and release it. Any multimedia played on the secondary screen, the audio still uses the speakers of the main device. For example, if I play a video on YouTube on the secondary display, I will get the audio on my laptop. Have a look. Hey what's up guys, this is my quick video on how to get the Jola phone UI on your Android device. So basically this is a launcher but you don't get this in the play store. And you also can use your touch screen as a trackpad on your secondary screen. Plus you can perform other tasks like you can pinch to zoom. Double tap will give you additional options like show hints, show keyboard which will bring up the keyboard on the secondary screen and other options. To connect your tablet via the USB cable, choose USB connection and make sure you have enabled USB debugging from the developer options. If you don't see developer options on your settings menu, go to settings, go to about device and tap the build number 7 times. This will give you the developer options. Enable USB debugging. So there you go guys, my Wi-Fi is not connected on the tablet but still I'm able to uh, use this as the secondary display uh, with the help of a USB cable. So the secondary display may not work seamlessly like the main display of your computer. However, it comes in very handy at most of the times like when you are writing an article and you need to watch a video, you can continue to type by watching the video on your secondary screen. And also uh, since uh, it's cable free, you can use it anywhere. And in case if you don't have a Wi-Fi connection, you can always hook up with a USB cable and you are good to go. So that's all for this video guys. I hope you found it useful. Thanks a lot for watching and you guys have a great time.